With two of Northeast Wisconsin's largest school districts, Green Bay and Appleton, starting the year off with 100% virtual learning, many parents are struggling with a new format. Tonight, NBC 26's Eric Crest spoke with a parent of six school-age kids in Appleton to find out about those challenges. Just weeks before the Appleton Area School District planned on allowing kids to return to class, they switched gears, asking parents to seriously alter their plans. We have six kids in the Appleton Area School District, uh, one in high school, one in junior high, and four in elementary. Joel Kelly says his older kids are doing all right with the new format, but it's his elementary aged kids that need quite a bit of assistance from mom and dad. The requirements are pretty brutal for the parents because for the elementary kids, we got to be there. Um, so if we didn't have my wife at home, I'm not sure what we'd do. And that seems to be a common problem for elementary age students who are tackling virtual learning this fall. It is a struggle for families. Appleton yeah, School Board President Kate Eagert has heard the concerns. Some students are doing well with it and they're doing fine with it and we are, that's great. In general, the younger the, the students, the more challenging it is. Eagert says her board continues discussing how to bring kids back to the classroom, calling it her number one priority. Our kids do the best when they are in person. But that doesn't mean that all parents are comfortable with the current game plan. We're the biggest district in the area. We should be leading the way with confidence. Of leaning on local health care leaders to inform the district when COVID-19 cases are trending down and it's safe once again to return to class in Appleton. The best relief is going to be when we get, get these kids back into school safely. Um, all the districts around our area are doing it to the extent where they have waiting lists. As soon as it is feasible, we will get those children back. That is our goal. In Appleton, Eric Crest, NBC 26. Eric, thank you. I know I'm struggling with just my two kids in virtual learning. They're elementary school kids as well. I just have two. My hat's off to the Kelly family for dealing with six kids. Wow. Appleton School Board President says her board continues preparing the kids to return to the classroom. She says by the time the decision is made, parents will likely get a two-week notice before school doors reopen once again.